the mic. So the we got contractors that we can't get a hold of, except, but we had, no, y'all just a great group. As I told Ken, thank God our message is greater than our building. And I mean, what Lisa did yesterday yes. was life-saving. And I heard what Pastor Linda did on Sunday, y'all. Yes. Oh, my yes, goodness. Lord. Excellent. Excellent. I'll say it again. It's a, we are blessed that our message is greater than this building built in 1921. No complaints. Okay. But to show you, this is for young men. Nothing we, we had an air conditioner, the storm knocked out one fan, no problem. Puts the fan in, not, the other fan has to be replaced, okay. Then the circuit breaker, okay. We up to $4,000, no, no problem. Comes in, puts circuit breaker on, does today, the compressor. Said we don't know, we don't know what happened, you know, so 4000 don't, don't flinch. I'm trying to help my men. Don't flinch. 4000 may turn into 90000 Do I look? What? You don't flinch. It's out of our control. Yeah. Okay? You have contractor for, she called for, never got back. That Sonia's doing a great job, and that Diego is, I say it again. And, and people are backed up. I told you, get into heating and air conditioning. Right. Okay, so we're going to get out of here. But I'm, I'm telling the men, and the, and there's single women that have to deal with this stuff who don't have no sugar daddy, right. no nothing. But it's out of, you don't panic, okay? We'll find a way to meet, all right, and get all this stuff done. But Sonia is doing a great job. She's yes. like, no, Sonia, you can't make contractors come out. So the guy came, he had hurt, he's such in demand, he hurt his back. So they still working on this. We're going to try to get out of here. But thank God, our message is greater than the building. It's going to get done. All right? But I know you're very spiritual. The Lord has made a way. Yeah, yeah. Because you know, when somebody's going to marry you, you got so much going on, somebody's going to marry you. And that stuff just, I'm telling you, stay on that front row, third row, as long as you can. That stuff just hits. It just hits. Ask any grown person. Uh, even our kids who, they they close on their home. You already close on, they close on the home. And then, not yet. And then you got the, the they going to close. Man, uh, your house payment is going to go up. My house went up $400,000. That's going to go up. Who cares? All right. Huh? All Who right. cares? Amen. Huh? A Bree left Berkeley to follow Davion. God is taking care of her. Amen. That's the attitude you have to have when it's out of your control. All right. Let's get these scriptures and get up out of here. Second Corinth, uh, Chronicles. We're talking about trusting in God. Mm -hmm. um, so, because you're a tither, I like talking to you because you got that. So, when, when your husband, please don't have a girlfriend in my lifetime. At least the way time did. Don't be a girlfriend. All right? Your husband, that stuff hits, it's going to hit. Can we help her? Something going to hit. Right. He might be religious too. You, you, you know, the Lord going to make, no, the Lord has made a way. All right? It's made a way. It's out of our control. Nature. Con when stuff is out of your control, you don't fall apart over it. You don't crash. Okay? When it's out of your control, you don't crash. You just flow with it. And that's why Chris and my daughter gave me the scripture. This is the day the Lord have made. Yeah. Yeah. Huh? So, it may not be 90, but this is what I'm saying. Some of the, if 
it may not be not it may be it does it's a still a good day yeah. does that make sense yes. it's still a good day so Sonia texts me, oh, boo, 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 boo. It's not a good morning. Yes, it is, Sonia. It's a good morning. Yes, it is. It's a good morning. Yes, it is. Huh? Man, you got to fight through that. This stuff is happening. You got memories. You got landmarks. You know, I lost my mother this month, 14, man, so many years ago. Oh, Amen. God. It's still a good day. Yes, this is the day the Lord have made. I got to rejoice and be glad in it. So what are you learning when you're talking about bitter conscience? You talked about the lean. The lean of hip-hop is the same lean that people drink to their own understanding. Right. I know she took it to another level. Huh? I heard she took that thing to a whole nother yes, level. Huh? Yes. Where you can get rid of your styrofoam cup, but back home you still got the ingredients. You got the ingredients. You got yep. your codeine. Yep. Huh? You, you got the Sprite. Your Jolly Ranchers. Yeah. Uh, and the car syrup. The car syrup. Man, all your life. Hmm? The reason why you're going to be a wife and something like this happens just one after another, boom, boom, is so you don't want, he might love you so much. as a song which you listen to that is so old school, older than you, that, that he won't panic because of what you said. Or don't say. Right, you're gonna find out, man. It, it, you gotta have more than beauty. Am I, am I telling them right? You gotta have more than beauty. People yes, can use your beauty. Yes, you gotta have words. Right. Uh, I don't know what we're gonna do. We're gonna trust God. How many times they're going to say that? We're going to trust God. I know, but I thought I saved the money, and the money I saved, we gotta put on it. It don't matter. We're gonna trust God, huh? Huh? That's why you married me. So, man, you got a little talk. That's why you married me. Huh? So we can trust God. Right, right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and your status goes up. Okay? Your status. Men, 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 men like Brian Bell to celebrate a great birthday. Just balling out of control. He balling. Eh, huh? If he and his wife ever ball out the same year, I don't know what they're going to do. But the beauty is they learn the lessons of not so far panicking under financial stress. Amen. Okay. Trust in God is more than just a couple of scriptures. Second Chronicles. Look at verse chapter 20, verse one. Now you're going to learn how you got to trust God, Brandon. When you're outnumbered, suppose your truck breaks down. Suppose two or three machines break. It's real, ain't it? Suppose yeah. somebody cancels. Okay. Suppose you like my real estate people go through a period where there were no sales. All right. If he, if Brian would have quit then, he wouldn't have had the month he had last month. Right. Amen. <laughs> and you have to learn how not to quit. Huh? <laughs> la la, you got to make that man go from fa 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 to la la la. That's in a song. Hey, Amen. Yeah. Oh, I bet he know the old cut. First Chron uh, Second Chronicles chapter 20. Look at verse 1. It came to pass after this also that the children of Moab and the children of Ammon and with them other beside the Ammonites came against haters. Yeah. I already know the, the sign. Haters! Yeah. Here they come. Came against Jehoshaphat to battle. To wage war. Uh, Bishop Jake said, even yesterday we were talking about, you got to know what you're good at. I was talking to Tinky. You got to know what you're good at. If you don't know what you're good at, then somebody's going to use you because somebody will see you good at something and won't even tell you. They'll take advantage of you. Do you know how hard it was for people to stand up and clap for themselves yesterday? I was watching. Huh? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Man, give me Coco's vocal range and see what I do with it. Yeah. I'm on the voice. I turn around. I, have, I bring my own chair to the audition. <laughs> you got oh, no sense. Go ahead. Uh, so what's your point? 
You got enough enemies without you waging war against yourself. Okay, I don't care what happened today. Look at me, man. I, man, I may have a hundred thousand dollar problem. Who cares? Huh? But my, and I may not. Huh? I may have a hundred thousand dollar problem with a million dollar a windfall. You better talk to me, huh? I'm up nine hundred bands. It's all up here. You gonna have enough enemies? Give me. Let me help my stunners. He don't want to deal with enemies and come home to an enemy. The Bible said it's better for him to be on top of a roof than to have enemies and come home to one. Okay? You got to learn that now for somebody to say, I do what we does based on their education. Read. <laughs> then there came some that told Jehoshaphat, saying, There cometh a great multitude against thee from beyond the sea on this side, Syria. Did the, did the Bible say a great multitude? Yes. Great multitude. Now you're going to learn uh, problems rarely come one at a time. Situations rarely come one at a time. Man, they just, they come in bunches. They come like bananas. Right? Read. Multitude against thee from beyond the sea on this side, Syria. And behold, they be in Hazazan Tamar, which is in Gedi. They be in Omaha. Something y'all got to identify with. Read. And Jehoshaphat feared and set himself to seek the Lord. You know what I love about this? That's an honest response when you got a bunch of enemies. Yes, sir. Yeah. Uh, all right. Y'all want to play? How about your finances is messing up? Okay. Your body start messing up. Come on, Bishop. Your kids start messing up. Come on. Your job start. I got to pray here. Woo. All the above didn't happen, and they here yes. praising God, man. Yes, huh? Yes, God. Stop. <laughs> you got to be, you got to watch where you go to church. I got somebody here. Everything I just listed has happened. Yes, God. And you can't tell who it is. They are clapping their hands right now. That's Amen. Right. Right. Why? Ain't no way in the world with what I bring to the table, God gonna drop Woo! it up right now. On, it's now. not my problem, yes. it's his problem. Yes. Yes, Lord. Come on, talk to God. Where yes, else he gonna find another you? Yes, God. This week. Yes, Lord. Yeah, that's why in your in in y'all with dating your data collection, there's nothing wrong with somebody like, you know, Cameron, you go be like, you know, you, you, you too weak. I watched my mama. It's me and my mama. My mama got married. My mama, all of a sudden, she was responsible. And one time they went out of town, and I had to get them all together. And I got up early. It was still late. <laughs> and I realized that my mama, for her to start over, she must really have love. And she showed me something. Huh? When you married a man, marry everything to come with him. Amen. Huh? And she did it. And when she couldn't do it, she reached up for help and took rebuke. Man, you know what? And that's all I know. I seen her do that. And here you, you, you buckling because you got a bad grade. That's how you got what? You buckling? Huh? <laughs> You getting put off the team because you can't get in the game with four seconds left? No. Oh. <laughs> no, we, we can't go to distance. You got to learn. See, your generation, you need to jump in bed before they find out what they in bed with. And we ain't talking about the sheets and the pillows. Oh, talk. Somebody can't handle pressure. Talk Same that. thing. Yes, sir. Same thing. Buckles under pressure. Too many things. There's some grown folk on Facebook now about to fight. Ain't no use you having a classy profile picture if you about to, you getting somebody to, <laughs> right. over, over a, a boyfriend. That kind of nonsense. Uh, what are you going to do when you have a bunch of enemies and fear jumps up on you? Uh -huh. Come on down. Hey, hi, hi. We got, get, let, let one of them sit, sit. Let the fashion plate sit next to you so you can step on her Crocs. She don't even know she's the fashion plate now. All right, now we, 
Step on her Crocs. There you go. Ain't that precious. <laughs> Multiple enemy. And so the, ne- the, the response is fear. Yep. Saints have fears. Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. Didn't Job say the thing that I feared the most? Yeah. Man, don't be, don't be religious and be fake. What's wrong with you laying out before God and saying, I'm afraid? Yes, Lord. Come on now. It's all right. I'm afraid. Lord, I don't know how this thing going to turn out in my, my, my mind. Come on now. Huh? That's good. That's good. It's easy to talk faith when you ain't going through nothing. That's good. Somebody going through something right now. They came to church. They ain't pouting on God. Tomorrow belongs to God. It could be straight now why they here. We know for a fact, man, that thing, I almost text you, but it was too late when I got it. Huh? We know for whatever it is, whatever yours is or mine is, he declared the end from the beginning. Yeah. So somebody praise God. I don't know how, but it go in because God ain't no liar. Okay. Your husband, he all met. Didn't you text him one time that God was messing with him? He a family man. Man, I'm about making money, taking care of my family. Didn't you text me? Because me and you like two, two toes in a bad sock. He said, he said, I know he's, he st- thank God. Thank God. Thank God. He's really, he, he, but I know I'm just, t- I can tell you now because it's over with. He balling out of control. But what's wrong with the wife said, but I can tell I sleep with him. I know he's afraid, but did you make it through? Last time I checked your account. But <laughs> Can I mess with y'all? Man? Don't marry nobody you can't be afraid around. Now you, now she want to call y'all kind of punks and stuff. Uh, no. Uh, that you can't have fear around? I'm afraid. Yeah. I'm trying to leave my family and they ain't messing with him. Took a story. You know the whole story. That, that was a couple of years ago. Y'all balling now. So write this down. We're about ready to go. Address your fears. He was afraid. Beautiful. Thank you. Talk to me. It's better to tell God and address your fears. Man, that's real, ain't it? Yeah. Tell God to address your fears. Then you faking like it and now your body's breaking down. Don't marry nobody you got to put a front on for. It ain't going to last. Okay, I'm afraid. This man was afraid. Read. And Jehoshaphat feared and set himself to seek the Lord and proclaimed a fast Uh throughout all Judah. Uh Uh-oh. Somebody here wanted to fast. It was something they wanted. And they fasted. They said, I want to bless them before their birthday. Didn't you close on a $500,000 house before your birthday? Amen. Why? Right. Huh? Mm. Now, 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 this is, this is, this is, this is next level. Anybody want to thank whatever came against you because it made you seek the Lord? Amen. Uh, 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 all right. Now, I'm say it again. Doc, uh, uh, Cousin Dre, let me talk to you. Anybody want to thank God for whatever came against you? Because it made you seek the Lord? Huh? No, not no pastor ball or corporate fan. You turned your own plate over, huh? Because you was determined you weren't going to buckle. You weren't going to quit. You weren't going to go back to whatever was pulling. Man, when you in trouble, other stuff start pulling on you. That's why she said get rid of that cup because you in trouble. You got a cup too? Man, man, man. Yo, man. Yo, mind tell you God don't love you. Oh, sure enough. If, if, if he really does, if this wouldn't happen. Huh? Yes, Those sir. thoughts ain't no joke. That's Bishop right. Jake said, hey, what, what, what's this all about? I wrote that down. What's this all about? Right, right. This man was afraid. Uh, I want y'all to, man, remember our building, what we teach is greater than our building. Amen. So you, 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 you will look at Character. What's this person going to do when they get in trouble? You're a basketball player, I presume, right? Okay. Uh, Scotty Pippen, don't forget what he said. He thought he was the man. When Michael retired, because he was gambling, Michael was just gambling. So he retired, and Scotty Pippen wanted to be the man. There's a dude named Tony Kukoc. 
and Tony Kuko hit the game-winning shot, and, and Scottie Pippen got mad because he thought it was him. When he became the man, guess what happened? C couldn't handle it. Uh -huh. He couldn't do it. Okay? Huh? Uh, put some respect on people who have been through. Amen. Uh, uh, let me say it in English. You may get, your mama gonna get some degree. You may get more degrees than her, but you don't know more than her. She came through pressure. All right. Much pressure. Huh? You gotta put some respect on Courtney. All right. I love my mama. No, you better respect what your mama is doing. That's right. Huh? Pressure. A house. She told me you used to get, was it you? You used to get mad when you see men in the store looking at her. Huh? Now, look, it had to be you because you, you just lied, you just told on yourself. Huh? What about if she was looking at those men? You may not be sitting here looking cute. Huh? Uh -huh. So she had to bypass, forget them looking at her. Post she looking at them, huh? Huh? And mama got, I gotta make a decision between my girls and something that I like. Oh man, y'all. <laughs> You don't even, what you, what you get as grown as you think you want to be. <laughs> Man, you're going to know that they sacrifice for you. Man, and the sooner you learn it, the better you're going to be. Amen. Because you're going to reap what you sow. They sacrificed for you. They did without. Amen. They had to shut their heart off and their emotion. Amen. And their sexual energy and everything else because they said to see a greater good. That's a war. Do I choose what I want to do? Do I choose what I should do? That's a war. I don't care how cute you are. He going to see somebody cuter. All day, every day. So I ain't going to last so long. Read. I like messing with y'all. Y'all look so tender. And Judah gathered themselves together to ask help of the Lord. They did ask. They did what? They asked help of the Lord. Ask help of the Lord. Even out of. Thank God there was no Facebook. Okay. That it got on their line. Hmm. They asked help of the Lord. Read. Even out of all the cities of Judah. They came to seek the Lord. Wow. Read. And Jehoshaphat stood in the congregation of Judah and Jerusalem in the house of the Lord before the new court. Man, Chris going to make it. Chris, my daughter gave him the scripture to go along with that. I'm looking for Chris to make us cry one day. All right. Is he Chris or is he Joshua? Right. For me and my house. Amen. Yeah. He already got hype. Man, wouldn't that man Chris who we thought we was going to lose? Chris who got Chris standing. Is it just the I am's or is he in a training class right now? A master class. Can we raise a Jehoshaphat who will stand up? Uh, guess what? Even if you don't want to be Jehoshaphat, trust me, life going to teach you how to pray. Sure enough. And it won't be cute either. Uh, don't worry. Just hang, hang, hang in there. I'm going to live to see it. I, I'm going to tell you, I told you. <laughs> that I'm going to speed off. <laughs> Read. And said, O Lord God of our fathers, art not thou God in heaven? And rulest not thou over all the kingdoms Is he of talking? the heathen? Yes, he's talking. Oh, Lord God of our fathers, yes. are not thou God in heaven? And rulest not thou over all the kingdoms of the who? Of the heathen. And in it's the bad when the heathen is in your family trying to mess over you. Okay. Huh? I told a beautiful wife today, I said, don't you waste another, don't rob your husband of the great woman you are worried about heathens. 
Let that heathen heathen on. Don't rob from him. Don't rob from your beautiful children. Let that heathen on. And t- hear that word again. Bitterhan. Trust God. God see- if you see him, God sees him. Okay? If you see him, God sees him. <laughs> this man talking. Read. And in thine hand, is there not power and might? When's the last time you told God? Yes, Lord. When the last time you took your eye off the hand of the enemy and looked at God's hands? Come on. Huh? Oh, they going to do this and they going to do that. What they did was they forced your husband out of a high V to make the money he making now. What? It didn't work. Anybody want to give God some praise? It did not work. They was going to run you out of there. They said you made too much money. You didn't make what you made left, but you still making money. Y'all both in there now, huh? Why? Anybody want to give God some prayer in his hand? He got power and might. Yes. Y'all play too much. Yes. He, you woke up with it, you're yes. going to go to bed with it. If you get up in the morning, he going to still have power and might. Just because he don't say nothing, don't mean he don't have power and might. Just because he's silent does not mean he don't have power and might. God is God over every disease. God is God over every condition. God is God over every piece of flesh. Somebody give God some praise. Amen. Don't just come to church. Realize who you're serving. Power and might. Huh? Sometimes, man, here's a class. Sometimes he allows stuff to happen. Oh, yeah. To see if you're going to trust him. Yes, Lord. <laughs> you, I'm like 10 years ahead of y'all. He'll tell you, he'll, just to see. Sometimes, and then you got to talk back to the devil that's talking to you. Amen. Amen. You got to tell it ain't going to work. Thank no, you. I'm not going to do that. Ooh. No, I'm not. Teach, Bishop. Teach. Huh? Yes, sir. Uh, man. Teach. <laughs> you got to holler back at him. Holler back at him. Oh, I know. I'm supposed to panic now. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. But, but I set under. Man, let me tell you something. Whoever Kobe married, going to remember he going to remember what Pastor Linda told him while he was sitting there right. unattached. That's right. Huh? If whatever she say, because she don't play with her. She, remember, she didn't she didn't raise three sons. Hey, Amen. And that man, man, I'm looking for a man in quite a lifetime. That boy, that man going to stand strong. No, I remember Pastor Linda, yeah, my mentor, is. said, yeah. don't you miss a mentor? Yeah. Hey, Amen. Yeah. Come on, you're going to put some respect on that person. Yeah. Huh? Y'all should have laughed a little 10 years talking about she didn't learn nothing. Don't let that be you. I know it's funny because she, hey, you better learn something. Amen. That mentor? Yep. Huh? If I'm 67, I'm still learning. You better keep your book cracked open. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> the day you quit learns the day you checking up out of here. Or you learn the hard way. That's why I told her mother to send her daughter, uh, you gonna learn, which basically means you haven't learned, but you will. That's right. <laughs> and I told her, don't say nothing else to her. Leave her right there. Sometimes you get too much dialogue, and it dilutes. That ain't no fancy word. It'll dilute your original purpose. Even when they respond, leave me. Hey, man, I, man, I'm a, I'm a hangman king. Am I right? Ask anybody. Talk to me. I'm a hangman king. All right, Bishop. I ain't got nothing else to say. Uh If you come in my office for anything other than crack jokes and play and talk about my shoes and whatever so we can have fun, and I stand up, that means you got to get up. Bye-bye. I ain't got nothing else to say to you. All right. Why? So you can, I know you can't cook, so you can marinate on what my last words were. All right, all right. That's on purpose. I know you can't cook. No, that's right, you can cook. Oh, Tasha can't cook. All right. Tasha can't cook. Can't <laughs> Marinate. <laughs> you mess with me. I mess. I told you, I had the mic. I'm going to get you. Mar- Got to make some room. Here you go. Come on, get that man a hand. Man, Woo! hey, man. Hey, man, going to get his family back. Amen. Uh, mentor. Yes. 
What do my mentors say? I'm, in, I'm under pressure now. You know why Spence got beat up? He tried to get ready for a man who never is out of shape. He tried to get in shape in eight weeks to fight a man who ain't never out of shape. Stay in the gym. Don't smoke, drink. Don't part. Per perfect his crap. Already, my son said, was already in Vegas a whole month ahead of time. <laughs> right. He's going to try to get ready. Uh, remember the last time you tried to crash for a test? <laughs> How'd that score look? A zero. How'd that score look? Studying uh, the night before. I know you want to tell me. I know what you got. You got an F. Sure did. And that wasn't for fine either. Minus zero. That was for flunking. Zero. You going to cram. I was there. That man. I was there, y'all. He beat his brakes off. He beat his brakes off. Mm -hmm. Huh? Yep. You know what he did? Makai? It's called catch and shoot. Come here, wait. Show me what catch and shoot is. Where you take. You, so Buzz said, when he hit him, and then the trainer, Diana gets up. No, not the trainer. Somebody said that, that, that don't blame, because I said, man, his, his corner shouldn't have let him come out that eighth round. Should have just said, no, like Porter's dad did. That don't come out. That Bud is a killer. Bud angry when he ain't fighting. No, no, ask, ask people that know him. Okay. Uh -huh. So he said, Spence clipped him, and he said, that's all he got? He knew it was over then. I almost think he carried him in the eighth round because he didn't want to, you know, he didn't want to hurt. He was beating him, people, beating him. So, so Spence, trying to make up for all that, trying to get ready for somebody who stay ready. Right. Show him what catch and shoot is. So you, you, you box it, and, and I, I might clip you. But look at his eyes. Go ahead, look at his eyes. <laughs> now, the people on go Facebook, ahead, they ahead. head out. That's why they get knocked the hell out. They head out. <laughs> okay. Now, mark it. There's a woman fighter named Nunez. She did the same thing. Look at his footwork. Look at his footwork. Ahead, Nunez wait. is a woman. <laughs> and a woman hit her, and Nunez still. Man, can you still look at the enemy when he hits you? Oh, this is good stuff. Can you? See, if you marry an emotional man, you're going to lose respect out of here. Because he ain't seen nothing. But if you get a man that I'll catch it. I don't blame the devil trying to kill me. I don't blame the devil for trying to destroy a priest. I don't blame him. I'm trying to take my family somewhere. But I ain't going to never take my eye out. Because catch it and then what? Bam! Fight. Crawford hit him with his back against the ropes. With a right hand. Caught it. Go on, May Lee. There you little dude. Okay, okay, okay. They used to call it girl fighting back then. No, watch, what? My wife's accused me of watching all the ghetto fights. I just want to see who can fight. They, they, then Wade, who no more, Wade said, if somebody's swinging you, the worst thing to do is, is go backwards. <laughs> Wade said, oh man, this is, we thank God, Wade, you in the church, bro. Yes, sir. Because you show, ain't nobody. Second degree, whatever. Wade said, you go forward. Oh, marry a man to go forward, Tinker. After he get hit, he go forward. Go forward, because you go backward, you're getting a straight line. That's how people get knocked out. They go straight back. And where you can catch a looper. If you go forward, the looper goes over your head. Huh? And then they said, all that gun smoke stuff, Bud hit this dude and his punch. Stay, it's a pocket, right? He stays in the pocket. His punch was like, he knocked him down with a jab. He just went like that from his shoulder. Marry a man that will punch whatever the devil come with you. 
and you stand back. My baby can fight. Who he beat up? He beat up poverty. He beat up depression. He beat up low self-esteem. He beat up what his daddy did. He beat up that his father didn't want him. He beat up all after the Holy Ghost. He beat up abandoned men. He beat up, amen, all the women pulling on him. He wasn't going to be a doctor. I can trust him. I don't accuse him. He beat He beat up lust. As Davion, he over there, stunners. Did between Berkeley and Metro Tech. <laughs> I ain't knocking Metro Tech, but there's a 365,000. And the women, girls that go there, are all, the, everyone in that school is talented. As Justin Timberlake. They was doing his song. He almost come up out that chair. The nerdy girl. Well, some girl was on bass. Nerdy. Looked like uh, some off the prairie. Bad as she want to be. Everybody in the school is bad. Justin Timberlake got up like, you know what? That's my song. Talented and pretty. But he came home with Brianna. Woo! And I've told her a thousand times, she needed to know it. Nobody in this church can say that Davion was messing with them. And that's good to know because you yes, in his hometown. Yes, First yes, of all, his mama yes. is a thug. She ain't having it. Ain't no way no son gonna do her like me and there ain't no way in the world. I ain't bringing home what hurt me. Not in my house. Some of y'all missed it. She talked to Lisa, man. Lisa took over, man. We talked about that one little 13 year old that, that only is around because her mom and daddy praying. The 16 year old boy that killed a 15 year old girl because she broke up with him. If that boy had came out of her womb, he would have thought he was dead while he was alive. Because you ain't going to sit here that angry because somebody broke up because you're going to take a life. Somebody didn't fight his anger. You know, I deal with stuff here. Yeah. Didn't fight his anger. Yes, sir. You marry an angry person. You don't went to bed with an angry, you done cocked your legs for an angry person. You done put your seed into an angry girl. You have messed your life up, but I can't fix it. Angry. Check their childhood. What are you used to? Huh? Now, nobody picks their family, but are you an overcomer? That girl right there is related by everybody in the city. That is a bad chick right there, y'all. She is an overcomer, boy. She don't, man, she the only hope the hope center got. Everybody in her family, man, she's talking about murders and incest and molestation and whatever, but that came out a woman of God. Rebecca arose amongst thorns. You can't pick your family. Huh? So their family don't nullify them, make sure they ain't overcome her. But no, that's what they used to. That's called secondhand smoke. Nobody picks their family. Uh, in the Bible, Rebecca family tried to get her to stay another day. Uh-uh, I'm out of here. Yeah, she, she didn't want to stay here. Oh, no. Now, the Hebrew version is, because somebody tried to stop them. The Hebrew version is harder than your Bible. Uh -huh. God killed them. <laughs> How about I read Hebrew? Somebody tried to hold up God's purpose. Some piece of flesh. Uh, you, 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 you really think you going to stop? Isaac is grieving. You think you're going to stop that? No, you're not. And it's got a time. God is, tell him, Vira, right on time. All the way. All on his time, not our time. Bishop Jake said time is God's employee. Yeah. That's the coldest statement. Yeah. God. <laughs> Time is God's employee. And somebody tried to mess with God's clock. Uh -huh. And the Hebrew version was, no, you're not. 
You out of here. <laughs> Rebecca come from a crazy family. Her father only kissed man, man, uh, that's Jake. Uh, she come from a, a crazy family. That man of God was sent. He sent, he put his whole wealth on the line so that his son could have somebody. And that girl come with that crazy family, but God. Oh, that crazy family, uh, that girl came out of that. Do your due diligence, though. Okay? You got to look and see what's up. You know some families don't have no standard? Sure enough. Come on, Bishop. Don't have none I'm trying to help y'all now. There's some family, the, nobody, no man in the family gets married. If you do something wrong with you. I had folks in this church, they, parents was Christian. They was against them being married. What kind of Christian, and was mad at me, but wasn't strong enough. Right. Huh? Right. Because when it came to that principle, they must have thought I was King Von in Old Block. Because I. Should never came in that. Should have never came in this area. Did you tell my son to get married? I sure did. And they cut their finances off when they got married. Christians. Okay. Don't don't feel bad for them. Please don't. They rolling. They 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 man. Don't feel bad for them. They doing better than everybody that was against them. I'm gonna say it in English. They doing better than everybody that was against them. Everybody who thought. Everybody who put education above their soul is doing worse than what they're doing. All right. Did they struggle a while? They had a car look like it needed proactive. I don't mean dense in it. They had a, a riding motor. Man, they were suffering. Stuff. But not today. Woo! That day is over with. Right. They have been blessed. Come on, I'm going to help somebody. They enjoying blessing longer than they suffered. Amen. Somebody tell suffering, you about to end. Amen. I'm going to be blessed longer. Read, because this man said, I'm going to go, I'm going to take this to the Lord. Read. And said, O Lord God of our fathers, and not, and art not thou God in heaven, and rulest not thou over all the kingdoms of the heathen? And in thine hand is there not power or might, so that none is able to withstand thee. Verse 7. Who are paying attention? Because I'm getting ready to go. Verse 7. Or not thou. Tell God what he's already done for you. Yes. Right now, no, tell God on, what he's that. already done for you. He already, help him, Todd, he already know, but tell God. God, I had a traveling blood clot, and you took care of this to where I did that. Tell God what he's already done for you. They wrote me off. They said my father was gone. They knew I had beauty and brain. But God, I graduated. I didn't come with no stroller. My stomach gave up. Tell God what he's already done for you. Amen. If you brought me through that, you can trust me in college. I have had to live a significant part of my life without my father. Somebody shout hallelujah. And if I made it through that, come on now. If I made it through that. Who in here got the testimony? You didn't have the money, but you made it through anyway. You didn't have the connection, but you got the job anyway. You didn't have the pedigree. Praise him, man. Huh? Our building, amen, is less than our message. Tell God. What he already did. Huh? Huh? You already got beauty for shot, but God, I remember we supposed to be evicted, but we didn't get evicted, amen. There was an I would have that eviction letter on the refrigerator door, amen. We were supposed to. I have a screenshot. Of the rejection letter, the one 
on my house and I woke up in it and I'm going to bed in. I kept a screenshot. God, if you can, if God says he's for you, he's more than one. If God says it's yours, it's yours. Tell him what he already has done. That's verse seven. Huh? You got you tell him. Read. I'm, I'm winding it down. Art thou not thou our God who didst drive out the inhabitants of this land before thy people Israel and gave it to the seed of Abraham forever. Forever. And they dwelt therein and have built thee a sanctuary therein for thy name's name. If when evil come upon us as the sword, judgment, or pestilence, or famine, we stand before this house and in thy presence. Uh-oh, for thy name is in this house. Yes, Lord. Yes, it is. And cry unto thee yes, Lord. in our affliction. Yes. Then thou wilt hear and help. Oh. Huh? Yes. Thy name yes. is in this house. It's in this house. Yes, Lord. Woo. Yes, it is. Remember the story I told when, when, when <laughs> I was reading the thrifty nickel, Tisha. Circling, got to get out of my house in Miller behind on payments. Huh? Back when it was answer machines, so long ago, what? Answer machine came on. I had left the post office. I've heard this before. You need to hear it again. You might not. You may be tired, but she ain't tired because she left a job. She left more money than I left. I leave, and I'm already preparing for the work. I know you can identify that. Because it looked like he wasn't doing nothing. Uh The answer machine came on. I needed $1,300. Which at that time, it could have been. That was like $13,000. Anybody know what I'm talking about? Amen. Right now, we we do. do, But but back then, the answer machine came on. And said, this is so-and-so from the post office credit union. And you have in your account. $1,300. $1,300. And man, I, man, this is with the thrifty nickel in my hand. It came on. Now, you know how you feel. I'm going to help you. You feel stupid. Because the money just wasn't that. The money was there while you was worrying, while you was crying, while you was like, this ain't going to happen, while you was already. I'm, I'm in the thrifty nickel, Michelle, circling something. Everything I needed. <laughs> I was so hurt, even though I made ninety some thousand dollars when I sold. But I didn't want to leave my place in Montreal because it was crazy. 18th floor overlooking the St. Lawrence River. <laughs> crazy place. I done loaded up the just huh? I'm gonna help them, man, because they're young. You, 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 you getting the job done, but you spaced out. You, you, you literally out of your body watching you make an adjustment in life. Am I, am I, anybody listening? Where, where you, you doing it? Can I help you? And then you can't cry no more. That, 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 that's the worst feeling. Amen. Because crying flushes your soul. But when you can't cry no more and you're stepping outside and you're watching yourself. And if you panic. Huh? Don't do that. Don't panic. If I would have. On 1804, that was my address, 1804, Duke Club Marin, on Nuns Island. And I remember Tracy Marsh text me, said, here are my ties, whatever. And so that, and whatever the amount was, it was God's way of saying, I ain't forgot about you. Right, right. 
Just keep on going. Keep on. I, I, just, 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 man, you don't understand it. You prayed me for it, but it's time to transition. Come on now. When the Brook Key River, don't worry about it. I got something for you. Amen. Come on, come I got on. something for you. Come man, on. I got something for you. Man, huh? I got something for you. Just go through this. Anybody, I just got to make it through that. Got to make it through this illness. I just got to make it through this thing. If I just make it through this thing, if I'm not going to quit the car, I'm not going to quit school, I'm not going to quit, I just got to make it through this. I ain't feeling it. My mind blowing. It look like I'm, mm. <laughs> Well, 1804 miles that had a payment. Kept going. Who can I talk to before I go home? The embarrassment. I mean, I made money, but. It was something I did not want to have to sell. Eighteen oh four with a note got replaced with thirteen oh four. That's paid for. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, but I, but I, can I help you? But I had to keep going. Right. Huh? I had to keep going. The steps of a good man are what ordered by the law. You got to keep going. Got to keep stepping. Keep stepping. Somebody going to love you, not your beauty. They're going to say, you know what? Because, uh-uh, you too great of a man to stop here. Uh -huh. If you was going to stop here, you should have never married me. Because I believe God, amen. And I believe the God that's in you. You got to know how to talk that talk when he's in trouble. He may not have no daddy. He ain't got no uncle. Everybody in the family done quit. They could be talented and gifted, but they all have quit. So he got quitting in his genes. Yeah, all right, come on. Can I mess with your son? That's help. But when you walk through. Yes. We ain't talking about shaking your butt. We talking about activating your mind, amen. All but when you walk through. Huh? His chest poke out. Come I'm on. not going to fall in front of her. She Come believe, on. oh, this is good. I'm not going to fall in front. I'm not going to quit in front of her. She brings out the man in me. Hey, Amen. I'm going to let you, yeah, baby. We got this thing. Oh, God. And you going to know that he was weak, but he held on to you. Somebody shout hallelujah. Hey, Amen. I can't quit. Hallelujah. If a quitter get with another quitter, Poverty one on one. That's right. Matter of fact, it, it'd be good to not without jumping in bed. Like you know what, you you ain't no. You ever seen dudes ball playing? They they act like they at Kyrie and whatever, but they can't finish. Then you got somebody like 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 the center for Denver, who everybody in the front row can out jump him, but he finishes. It's embarrassing what he do to the brothers. He finishes. He don't jump. He just good. He just, he just no, he, he great. And they doing all this and whatever and, 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 and can't finish. All right. You know, the finisher. That's how I talk to my son here. He got finished, bro. If he do what I tell him to do, because, you know, you just run like you ran for Burke. Yes, yes. Everything that you think is Ain't no way. God said, who says who? Right. Huh? But you got to have a candidacy. Every time I tell Candace, she do it right away. So her natural mind, man, you know, she a real woman now. She ain't no, so before her mind kick in. Right. You know why you do it right away? Because uh, uh, he don't understand. I'm not into understanding business. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Where you seeing my understanding office at? I ain't showed up. No. Uh -huh. We talked about it today. Two things I told her to do, she did it both times, boy, and has reaped the benefit. Amen. For her natural mind. So she beat, man, man, one time, man. And, and she'll tell you, and I'll tell you something hard, because it's really not me. It's got, that I really ain't. Mm. She be crying. She, what time she's crying? Yes, sir. The rest is history. That's right. For that natural mind kick in. Come it was a thousand percent against what she was feeling. But kicked in. The rest is history. All right. She is, here's your cooking word again, marinating in the blessing. Yes. 
of listening to wise counsel and obedience. Marinating. Marinate me is soaked all the way through. And if you wait for her to go down anytime soon, you got a better chance of Farrakhan being Catholic. And that ain't happening. Huh? No time soon. She already been down. Man, I want to talk to somebody. That down period that that devil fight you about, you go, it's over with, baby. You already proved it. Who in here said he talking to me? That down, bottom down, this is it, Kenny Loggins. If Satan can take a Cardi B, man came in there and said, girl, with that kind of body, you could be making some money. She lived across the street. She said, I got my teeth fixed, boop, 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 whatever. Now she, she got five cars, Lamborghini, what it can't drive, whatever, huh? Mm. The microphone she tried to throw, because she's still hood, throw the microphone, the microphone, she couldn't even afford that microphone. She couldn't afford the water that was thrown on her. You mean to tell me a Satan can raise up a Cardi B? Huh? She went from serving drinks to getting on a pole to whatever. Huh? huh? You And God? God is less than a devil that raised up a Cardi yeah, Man, you tripping. Huh? Huh? I want somebody to believe God for about five seconds. You don't care about nobody else in your role. It's time to be selfish. It's hot as hell in here. You ain't got nothing to lose but to be your perm already gone. Your, your, your baby hair rising up being an adult. You need to go ahead and pray God. Ain't no way God sent me to North High School for Courtney for her daughters to be destroyed. Brashana ain't destroyed and the daughters ain't being destroyed. Brashana spent years being a girlfriend, that's why I tell her, but now she's a married wife with a son. Come on, man. Ain't no way in the world. God ain't through with Dave. Dave has done too much good. Dave helped the ball over. Dave gonna make it through this thing. Dave gonna be a good dad. Dave gonna be a dad to the little boy that's already here. He been through enough. He seen enough. Amen. He better be to bring that girl in the sacred. We got this. This ain't Salem. Come on, you better bring that on in here and be the man. You've led too many young men. It's your time to lead. <laughs> Too much. If this was it, you didn't did. You got, you got too much seed in the ground. You got too much good. You didn't did. <laughs> oh man, you better talk to God. Mm-hmm. If God brought you out of fire. Come, care what you pay. That fire still came to that dorm. You came out. You came out. Huh? You didn't even ruin the goose I got, right? Darnetta had a, I gave her a thousand dollar coat. It got ruined. She thought I was mad. Man, I gave you the coat. Come on now. Darnetta can't. Darnetta was worth more than the coat. Look at her now. That was a lawyer that a devil tried to burn up. One more time. Uh, somebody talk that talk to God. Come on, Quana. You were supposed to be in that backyard catching that bullet in the head, but you didn't. Amen. Ain't nobody at your restaurant, ain't nobody at your business know anything about you. You are a survivor. Not only did you live, but Tamika lived, and Brittany lived, and now Kobe lived. You should have been in that backyard getting assassinated, but you didn't. Tell that and get filled with the Holy Ghost. That person ain't holding up nothing, Wade. That's for you to talk God. Talk to God, amen. God said, I'll move when you move, amen. If you praise God and give the Holy Ghost, they don't care how much money it got. There people got that money in a drawer. It ain't about the money, it's God. If you, I said, uh uh-uh, uh, uh, I'm gonna move with. You praise me. You get the Holy Ghost. 
Watch what happens. You got to talk that talk. Anybody have to wave some under God's nose? What kind of life y'all live? Let me finish up because my, my throat. Read, read. May Lee, real quick. Verse if, 9. If when evil cometh upon us. Come upon us, evil, evil jumps you. <laughs> As the sword, judgment, or pestilence. Uh, here's a whole list of stuff. Or famine. I wish it was just evil. But look what else comes. Sword, sword judgment, judgment, pestilence. Pestilence or famine. Famine. We, we stand before this house and in thy presence, for thy name is in this house, and cry unto thee in our affliction. Then thou wilt hear and help. For now, behold the children of Ammon and Moab and Mount Seir, whom thou wouldest not let Israel invade when they came out of the land of Egypt. But they turned from them and destroyed them not. Behold, I say, how they reward so, so, us. So watch this now. It, so Sonya hit me up. She said, I got bad news. It wasn't a good morning. The air conditioning do boo 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 And this is what happened. You know, the people that I called to do the work out there, they return my call, boo 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 Sonya, it was still a good day. Yes. Yeah, but no. So she said, then she said, then she realized who she was talking to. Uh-huh. Because you can't be with me and I'm going to babysit you. She said, I repent. I receive that. Amen. Amen. Huh? Yep. <laughs> it's still a good day. What nothing that we didn't do, it is still a good day. Huh? I said, Sonia, and I had I had I had Leandre and Kenneth. You know what I was out at a meeting. I said, our message is greater than our building. Amen. Our message is greater. Uh, furthermore. Let Lana win anything. Yes. Woo. No, I said Lana. I didn't say you. Now, you got to know the difference. <laughs> Lana will have us in a presidential suite. All right. The whole floor. All right. Why she hired contractors to do it all at once, man. No, 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 that, that's what's on. All right. We don't, and it, we don't, I don't care how God do it. Amen. We ain't sweating it. And we can do it. But, but, it is, but today is the day that counts. When stuff just comes, That's right. stuff just hits you. I've seen some of y'all, man. You know what? I know it's, 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 it's what, August the 2nd? But you done had a year of surgeries and pain. And you, you don't need no choir, no mass choir. You got to praise, amen. At any moment, you could have quit. I remember when KT came back to the sanctuary. He was urinating glass, y'all. Amen, man. Who in here, oh, God, some praise, amen. Man, if I was going to quit, I wouldn't have waited till August the 2nd. In pain, didn't let nobody know. In pain, all kind of illnesses, all kind of stuff happening. And you refused to quit. Yeah. Huh? Oh, verse 11. Behold, I say, how they reward us to come to cast us out of thy possession. Of thy possession, which thou hast given us to inherit. Huh? That, that hater related to somebody in the church. Gonna put on faith, but how did he get that house? Huh. Well, you need to go and pull that up again since it's county... See where it doubled. <laughs> How you get that out? She thought she was killing me. Anybody want to lose something? I bet I live better than her. It ain't even close. Put it all out on Facebook. Try to destroy me. See, some of y'all, that's why you have never had people try to destroy you. Hmm? Think Victor and the young and the restless. He ain't going nowhere. Huh? Think the fast and the furious. No matter how many times the car flip, <laughs> the fast and the furious. Huh? I tell you who did die. Whoever Horatio pulled up on after that commercial. <laughs> they gone, y'all. 
They gone. Yeah. Huh? Whoever Horatio pull up on. If you see the Hummer, somebody died. Huh? Think MacGyver. I don't care if it's four seconds left on the clock. You notice that a clock can say four seconds. They do a whole minute commercial and they come back. The clock ain't moved yet. That MacGyver going to be there for next week. Come on now. Huh? Help, man, come on now. How many? Oh, man, now I'm going to get personal. How many times have you written yourself off? Huh? And you say, since ain't God ain't for me, I'm just going to go back to what I know how to do best. And God said, I'm going to show you that I put something in you. You ran into the person you thought, and man, you frosted up on them, and you got to cry. You didn't know you had the strength. Somebody better give God some praise. Amen. You better have him down. Thy word have I hid in my what? Heart. That's what she said about that cup. If that heart is dirty, you'll fill that cup right back up again. You may have a couple of styrofoam left, but some, that clean heart got rid of them. It's harder now because of your heart. Thy word have I hid in my heart. Oh, sin against you. Huh? Let's finish up. Read. Oh, our God, will thou not judge them? Yeah, he going to judge them. For we have no might against this great company. We, we, we defenseless. Told you way. We the fence look like it looked, man. I told my it always looked like they winning. Yep. That cometh against us. They ain't winning. Neither know we what to do. <laughs> we, but we, our eyes are upon thee. We uh oh, here we go. We done. And all Judah Thy cometh against. We have no might against this great company that have come against us. Neither know we what to do. Ain't nothing wrong telling God, I don't know what to do. Yep. It's better to say you don't know what to do than do something that's out of it. Than to take that cup full of that lean to your own understanding. Remember the analogy, Brandy, when I'm trying to learn how to be a hel fly a helicopter? And the man said, the man, remember, he can fly like black people skate. Backward, forward, sideways. Just, he said, you know what? He said, Mr. Barlow, if, if, you, if you do this, we both did. He said, I can't bring us out. If you take that sickly and you do this, any sudden, I told you, any sudden move, he said, I can't bring us out. But if you do just, just a little move like this, just a move like that, and you'll be over there in a helicopter. Helicopter is no joke. Just a little move like that, and you're over there. A little move like that, you're way over there that right there he said I can't bring us out so I have people that my, my instruction is so simple I don't want folks to do it as you are right now no what huh no but you know what changes the game When God fill you with the Holy Ghost, that's a game changer. There it is. Because you ain't operating out of your feeling. You got power now. And man, God, like, I, you know what? I'm going to wait until you, you got to want me more than you want this situation in. There it is. That changes. How many of y'all know I'm telling them the truth, boy? That changes the game. Oh, so you don't have me on a timer. No, God, you waited on me. I, I, I. Who in here said, God, wait on you? Not no one year, not two years, not three years. I know some of y'all came in here. One, well, got my daughter, 16 years old, still with him. Maybe that's 25 years. Amen. He did the God wait. Who in here did God wait on you? How many of y'all did God wait on you while you were sitting in here? Oh, Lord, I sitting right in here, but God waited on you. And you tell God, well, it's my turn now, but I'm going to praise you. But, but my, I might as well just go ahead and go for it since things ain't moving for me. I think I just go ahead and move. Uh, mm. It's so simple. That's what folks do. 
Because your, 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 your natural mind can't wait to mess your life up. And then, you, then you say, oh, it can't get no worse. Yes, it can. Oh, yes, it can. Yes, it can. Don't ever say that in life. Yes, it can. Yes, it can. Yes. Real quickly. Yes, it will. Get worse. Uh-huh. Okay? Uh-huh. <laughs> Read. This is good for y'all. Y'all listening. I don't know why. Neither do we what to do. But our eyes are upon thee. You're looking at the wrong thing. Our eyes are upon thee. Yes. How about saying, God, you got a time. And when God say it's time. It's time. No one. Yes, Lord. No one. No one. Huh? No one. Huh? Then you get a testimony. Because you don't follow nobody. I was obedient. I was kept. I, I, man, I, man, I saw God. Amen. Yeah, yeah, huh? That's yeah. your testimony. That's it. That's it. Huh? And then you honor. I didn't think it was going to happen. There were days I had to encourage myself in the Lord. I said somebody, uh, some music, some song. Lord, do it for me. Uh, 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 right. uh, dependable God. Intentional God. Man, you got a man. It's going to be a day. Nobody going to call you, text you. You got to get up. I had a tough July, but man, I got up, man. Come on, man. I thank God. Everybody gets tired. Our eyes are upon thee. And all Judah stood before the Lord. Uh-oh, here we go. With their little ones, their wives. And their children. Their wives. Their wives. And their children. Mm-hmm. Okay. Let me jump ahead. Then here come a prophet. The prophet said in verse 15, and he said, Hearken ye all Judah and ye inhabitants of Jerusalem, and thou king Jehoshaphat. Thus saith the Lord. God has used cocoa in a word of knowledge. Thus saith the Lord unto you, be not afraid nor dismayed. Huh? Remember, Bishop Wagner, before he died, came to this church and put a word. So everything that happens has to line up eventually with what he said. That's right. He's dead. He ain't coming back and teach it again or preach it again. Right. It's on cassette. That's how old it is. But it's still good. <laughs> Prophecy's good for 400 years, y'all. It ain't been that long. Right. That was too good for y'all. Thus said the Lord, be not afraid nor dismayed by reason of this Great multitude, more than one thing, they can all be against you. Can't, it ain't going to work for the battle. Is not, the battle, the battle is, is not, not yours. yours. <laughs> Uh-oh, did I talk about God say mine and yours? Yes. See, you can do it another way. My thought, your. No, this ain't your. This is mine. mine. Hey, oh, boy, is Lord, mine. this is mine. <laughs> This is mine. Get out the way. This is mine. I am going to fight for you. I saw you coming to church. I saw you breaking down in the parking lot. I saw you see this. It ain't going to never change. I'm going to always be unhappily married. I ain't mean, never going to happen. I'm going to always be by myself. No, I'm going to show you. I was watching you teach Sunday school. I was watching you, sir. I was watching you rebuking amen the enemy while you were sitting in here. I'm going to fight for you. I guarantee you, if I speak you into 10 years from now, You'll be there, amen. Ain't nobody got more power. Everybody wanted to go down, to, but but how come your name came up? You ain't the only engineer at Apple. Right, right. Yeah, man, that God, when God hands pick you, it man, yeah. don't be afraid. Tomorrow, tomorrow, so the battle's yours, but God's. Yes, that's leaning not. See, if you lean. <laughs> You done, you done took the fight out of God. God said, I'm not fighting for you. Brandon, didn't the man, the man said, do this, sell Scottsdale, do this, do this, and then come back. I'm not knowing. The wealthy man was like, this is a done deal. I'm not, he didn't tell me that to last, this year. I did everything the man said. Came back and denied me. I'm going to keep telling y'all because sometimes I can say, but you're not going through it. Right. Right. Huh? Right. Uh, 
leaning to your own understanding is quitting. That's for the Williams family should have gave up a long time ago. Your ducks weren't in order. They're going to still call. Duck. Don't worry. If God say you're going to be there, ain't nothing in hell going to stop you. I'm going to say it again. They came with some mess on you, didn't they? I didn't ask permission. I went down the area. The, 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 the Spanish workers let me in because I had the Rolls Royce, so they just knew I was somebody. Amen. I walked in there, went to the room, and saw you in your library. And I saw the giant sitting on your couch all stretched out. I think unless you fake it, you going back there tonight. Am I right? Amen. God said, I don't care about no underwriter. The underwriters got a piss too. Amen. They got to get up in the morning too. Ain't nobody stopping. And when I say I want you in that neighborhood, somebody got healed when you pulled in the car to say, the neighbor ain't. That man literally thought I did everything he said. And I broke down in Paris on the very anniversary of my mother's death, August 14th. And I got a screenshot of a woman saying, you were denied. Then I go to this dude, Don. Man, I hope I see Don. I don't care where I'm at. I bet Don see me before I see him. Went back and Don turned it down again. Because I don't want no black man in that kind of house. I'm not knowing what my man did. My man doubled back on him. You did what? That's supposed to have been a rubber stamp. But if it been a rubber stamp, I wouldn't have no te testimony, right? Couldn't have been a rubber stamp. Huh? Uh, a man, he's in a, what kind of guy? Intentional. I'm not knowing this. My man pulled all his money out. I'm going to send somebody to your, my bank, and he's going to do everything you said, and because he did it, he stepped outside and looked at the white hair cat, and well, maybe if you come back, uh-uh, no, God wanted me there in September of 2017, permanently. All right. I said September of 2017, permanent. On that day, amen, huh? 18, man, on that day is when we go, God said, you going to be in there and ain't a devil in hell. The gates of hell will not prevail against you on that September day, 18, 2017. You going to be in there. The man said, I'm on my face in Paris, man. The man, I called him and like, man, I got turned down again. He said, I'll call you right back. He said, me and my wife, we want you to have that house. Try one more man. And the man I tried got it done. I keep telling y'all this because somebody needed it. Because somebody is giving a devil and a principality more power than they're giving God. If God be for you. Jody, if God be for you. I want God to tell somebody, I'm for you. You quit worrying. You get you a good night's sleep. You get you some hog and dog. You get some chips and dip. Put a pout on your hip. I got you. <laughs> Praise him, Quanah. Go on, get filled. Amen. Huh? God said, I got you. <laughs> and get what happened, y'all. Then he said, tomorrow, got to follow instruction, go ye down against them. Behold, they come up in the cliff of Ziz, and ye shall find them at the, told them where they were at. Yep. At the end of the brook before the waters of Jeruel. Uh-oh, verse 17. Ye, shall. Darnetta, shall not need to fight in this battle. Set yourself, stand ye still. And see, see the, the salvation. salvation of the Lord with you. I don't need no movement out of you. Come on, come on. Oh, Judah, Jerusalem, and? fear not, nor be dismayed. Tomorrow go out against them, for the Lord will be with you. And Jehoshaphat bowed his head with his face to the ground. And all Judah and the inhabitants of Jerusalem 
fell before the Lord were what? ain't nothing left to do but to worship the, the Lord. After God give you instruct, after God has told you you already won, ain't nothing left but to worship. Go on and get your worship in, winner. Amen. You got to get your worship in. Don't mess my story up because you ain't worshiping. If you're not worshiping, that means you're worrying. Oh, that was deep. I said, if you're not worshiping, you still worrying. Tell me how I'm going to win it. You ain't got to win it. It's already been won for you. That's that lean. That, that purple cup will mess your life up. Wow. And the Levites are the children of Israel. Children of the Kohenites. Kohathites. And the children of the Korites stood up to praise the Lord God of Israel with a loud voice on high. Got their worship on. And they rose early in the morning, got banned. And went forth into the wilderness of Tekoa. And as they went forth, Joshua stood and said, Hear me, O Judah, and the inhabitants of Jerusalem. Believe in the Lord your God, so you shall be, uh-oh, established. Yes. Believe his prophets, so you yes. shall yes. prosper. That's a good word. And when he had consulted with the people, he appointed singers unto the Lord that should praise the beauty of holiness. And as they went out before the army to say, praise the Lord for his mercy and do it forever. And when they began to sing and to praise the Lord and set ambushments against the children of Ammon, Moab, Mount Seir, which will come against Judah, and they were smitten. For the children of Ammon and Moab stood up against the inhabitants of Mount Seir, only to slay and destroy them. And when they made an end of the inhabitants, everyone helped to destroy another. Lord, have mercy. Turned them on each other. And when Judah came to war to watch the tower, they looked into the multitude, and behold, they were dead bodies falling to the earth, and none escaped. Somebody shout hallelujah. If God say you won, you're going to win. Amen. It's a done deal. Come on. You might as well finish up your worshiping before you go back to worrying. Hey. Why? Because you bit the car. You trusted in God. That purple cup, that lean, you'll lose everything. Why you talk to me? Watch this now. Why you tell me just be a man of God? Why can't I get it then be? No, because who they with now is not a man of God. I'm trying to get you to shine. I'm trying to get you to shine against the opposition. I don't care what folks say. Folks say stuff to get a rise out of you. But when you a man of God and you calm and you not the wild, crazy, threatening person, not because God is. You shine. You start shining. You can't shine with that purple it cup. That's good. You shine. God's for you shine. Uh-oh, God, how you going to do it this time? You shot every head bow. That's all I'm trying to make. I'm trying, I'm trying to get them to compare themselves to you. And it's in you. That's why it's so hard. I want to do it my way. No, you'll mess up everything. You'll mess up everything. I'm trying to tell you. I can't do the cartwheel. I can't do the split. Every head bow. Pray, KT. I think I got out in the nick of time, didn't I? Oh, 828. Two more minutes. Pray, KT. Precious Lord, Father, and Savior in heaven. Lord, thank you for teaching our hands to trust in you. Thank you for teaching us that we need to be still and know that you are God. That we need to lean not into our own understanding, but get out of the way. And let you fight our battles. Ooh, boy. We need to be obedient, Father, and trust your word. Every soul that heard it tonight, Father, bless them. Ooh, God, let him get it all. <laughs> to get out of the way. Get that lean out that cup. To get out of the way. Pour that codeine out. To get out of the way, Lord, and let you do your thing. You're destroying yourself worrying. Because <laughs> it look impossible. Oh, I just don't want to be fake. I feel like I'm fake. No, anytime you, you hang on to God, that ain't fake. That's real. 
pray, man of God. We will be obedient to your word, Father. I know I will be obedient to your word. I heard about that haagen In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. I, he, he, he done scooped up on the... On, on. <laughs> <laughs>